So that's what they are looking at. So what they are looking at innate talent is not all about. It is it, that's not what will get you to the end of the mm-hmm, goal mm-hmm. to become world class. It's all about preparation. Mm-hmm. Preparation and what did they say? It was working hard. And what did the world class people do? They worked much harder than the other people. Mm-hmm. So in today's world we sort of entered into this uh, mentality of okay, you guys also give me a view of this is what I think about it. Mm-hmm. You know, work smart, work smart. Everyone is saying work smart, smart. but mm-hmm. what, what is working smart? The people who are able to work smart, at first they had to really work, work hard. hard. True. Like day in, day out, you're putting in the time. Like yeah. trading even when you're at chat eight hours a day. Exactly. Like ten thousand hours. You're mm. putting in that screen time. Screen time. If you if you're jogging, if you keep jogging, you've said mm-hmm. it's taken twenty years to become mm-hmm. a world class. All that time preparation is putting in the work. So that's where now working smart for example now let's say you've worked hard kina Cristiano they've worked hard first 20 years mm-hmm. by the time now they're 20 now they start working smart remember yeah. they were already become a master but now what may I think now they start working smart in terms of what diet to take mm-hmm. how many times i need to jog also how business, many hours they need to business sleep part also is the also business part smart. now mm-hmm. they, now that's working smart mm-hmm. now people sort of are trying to cheat this work smart now even before you work hard <laughs> <laughs> stop working <laughs> hard what are you working work smart. smart for <laughs> there's that part for working hard exactly. don't negate mm-hmm. it you mm-hmm. have to put in that 10000 hours mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. if you're asking now I was doing the math so now that now maybe of going we have brought this up 10000 hours what is it so <laughs> what so it takes to what achieve, it takes to achieve hours. the time so let's say for example you people let's say are trading you're putting in 2 hours a day 5 days a week let's say we can't do a rest we go we add it ah wait listen listen stop skipping my process we're going step by step stop skipping but it's good you already agree with it so if you're putting 2 hours 5 days a week Okay and you're working 50 52 hours you're going to take 20 years. Mm. So 2 hours too. Mm. Eh, kidogo. Eh, eh, kidogo. Mm. 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 Focus yangu iko ngifiti ya 5 days a week. Um 20 years so. Now if you put in 4 hours, ongeze tu 2 hours. 5 days a week you'll take half the time. You so take 10 years. years. Okay. If you put 6 hours a day, 5 days a week, you'll take 6 and a half years. Mm-hmm. Okay? 6 hours that's how manzo can increase. Ah. If you put 8 hours a day, which is ideal, 8 hours a day because you have a full time hours. job. Yeah. Now let's you're doing this full time. 8 hours to send me to on the minimum side, mm-hmm. you're doing it full time. 8 hours a day, 5 days a week you'll take to reach 10,000 hours, 5 years. That's reasonable. Which is reasonable. That's what I'm saying mm-hmm. that one is an ideal. Exactly. If you put in 5 hours a day. Okay. Uh, I mean 8 hours, hours a day. Sorry. 8, eight hours, hours a day. But now days. you also need to look at the brain science. Your brain can't work 8 hours a day on something deeply. You'll be doing shadow yeah. work. Now now there's and remember over here I've taken also 5 days. So I've sort of to say me I took it to 6 and push it into the weekend. I think so so the ideal number according to research is 45 hours. That's the amount of time that your brain can really focus on something. If deeply. you do that. Yeah, exactly. that's that's between 8 to 10 years. Exactly. So that mm-hmm. way it will take you like you can't a long cheat. time. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You can't cheat. It will take you probably a decade for you to become exceptional yeah, exceptionally. or something. Exceptionally. And yeah. that's why now we keep saying this guys who started at 12. They are better. Mm-hmm. And you also By know at 20. You, there's that also. There's the young age, but there's also the young brain and then there's the focus. Like of course, yeah. The minute you go 28, 29, I've already built in very bad habits. Very so it's hard to it's hard to teach a 30 year old how to focus <laughs> like you teach a 12 13 14 year old you should not True. build some of these things earlier on in life life yako iko honestly fucked up like of course yeah it's hard to change some of these things but you can keep choge says sorry to cut you short mm-hmm. keep choge man keep choge yeah. man <laughs> The best time to plant a tree was 25, 25 years, years ago. ago. <laughs> But the yes, next best, best time, time is now. Is now. Yeah. We're not saying it mm. can't be done. Of course. Yeah, At least yeah, yeah. of course. Anza tu. Mm. Yeah. Ukishaanza tu, usha conquer yeah, yourself. Five years ago was zero years. <laughs> Kwa zero. Hata hapo ndo ngaanza kusoma tu. Cuz I was not like, there. There's a book, a very good book called The Defining Decade. And it's about your 20s so they argue that in your 20s if you don't build in some of these things. Yeah, if you don't define it. If you don't define what you really want in your life if you get that is gamoja mwa vizuri mali and this is in your 20s now yeah. Yeah. now imagine the guys who started at in their 10s exactly no, and no. imagine hey. if kipchoge started it they at 10 exactly mm. so and you know the bad at thing kipchoge is, you're saying what 
imagine if he started uh, like at a young age because for him he started i think uh, 18 yeah. 17 18 yeah. some guys started look, 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 at, look at exactly. look at yeah. Omanyala. he didn't start a long time mm-hmm. but like he's still four, four yeah, after, after high school probably yeah, yeah, after yeah, high school yeah, yeah. yeah true 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 so, so it's also here. it can't be it can be done i mean it mm. can be done mm. not saying it can't be done but you'd have a, a better advantage if you like i'd really if i found someone who has left high school and is deeply interested in trading or deeply interested in a subject and they're willing to put in the time and the hours and they have narrowed in on that they've zeroed in on doing what they're doing i'd really shall like to see how that person will develop mm. yeah like on the 10 year journey uh, but you know Walker. if i think about it that's basically us because like mm-hmm. for me i was in school for only two years university yeah so i went for the i was in school for me i was in for three months <laughs> So I went for a semester. Mukofi <laughs> <laughs> And then after a semester I left and then I went in for another semester. But I wouldn't say for the first the second like let's say I started trading at 20. Yeah, basically. Mm. I imagine ago. someone who started at 18. That's Taras. Or 15. Or 15. That's the 15 now is the perfect age. Yeah, the age. And yeah. you're able to and you're focus and you know what hours, it takes. Yeah. Now that one is a legend man. He stand out by the time you're yeah. 20 and this this what you see many people abroad yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm. To mm. become an outlier PC because you're competing against many people. True. So to become exceptional man because like Michael let's take an let's go Which to the Michael? third point. Phelps or Mike Phelps. Okay. Let's go to the third point. What's the third point? Wakethic. Okay. So okay. yeah. Ume decide sasa nataka kuwa outlier umeamua. Mm. I want to be an outlier to be the best at what I'm doing that's my goal my friend you're competing against people who are putting in insane number of hours like michael was working he never missed a single day of practice for six years mm-hmm. so, not a single not day. a single day where he didn't swim mm-hmm. and he said if you miss a single day of swimming you have to take two days to replace that day so you can't miss because you want to double days. my work exactly uh, mm. that's one But now even to make it worse is in a day he had four training sessions mm. two and a half hours in the water the first session mm. then lifting weights then again some sessions in the water eh serious yeah so the whole day to akuko eh so like different places that was the thing like different environments and he, he said he would visualize like how the race would go how he would turn like he had everything everything figured out to perfection to perfection before he even swam mm. you get mm. and i think i also got the same from kobe like kobe would say if if you're playing a team and you're the one to take the finishing shot because in basketball you can win by just a basket or mm. just one three point so you really have to be keen on the last maybe 20 30 seconds of the game mm. for the last quarter now there are people who are exceptional at finishing the game like you'd seen the last dance how mm. michael would finish mob Jordan mm. hey Jordan Jordan mm. so Kobe will say now he was told you you're the one to finish and so when you're the one to finish a game you have to study how the team the opposing team you're playing against how they double in on or they zero in on someone who's known to finish the game because there's a lot of pressure at that moment mm. maybe you've tied so the whole game is studying the other guys exactly mm. no before the game mm-hmm. so before the game so he was saying so this is the story if If he went to a game and he would observe he's been given the ball and then he gets a double team so a double team is basically two people are going to take the ball away from you or two people are trying to cover yani so you can't shoot you can't pass like uko mtu mmoja ko free wewe umeshikiliwa na watu wawili so in most cases people would pass the ball you get but if you're passing the ball you'd never prepare well for that finishing shot mm-hmm. so what you do is you study how these people attack on the double team so he would tell that okay if i'm on the d side these people will come in straight like this or in this other angle mm-hmm. so he would change up make sure he's at the corner on the finishing shot mm. such that if you try to attack it from the corner he knows you guys are perfect at coming from this point mm-hmm. but at that point you're weak mm. so if you're coming in double i'll be faster than you the two of you mm. and then i'll shoot mm. so before you i may shoot na kaenda mmaliza hiyo game na hiyo story mesha But well, you can see realize. how well prepared that is like mm-hmm. there's no second guessing yourself I'm a, nini <laughs> mm-hmm. and the same is applicable in trading mm-hmm. the minute you're in a trade which you have not well prepared for those are the times when anzanga quite emotional of course when from 
long to short unaanza trades should be well prepared for like way before way before like you know if this market does this this is how i'm going mm. to do it if mm. this market does this this is how i'm going to do it mm. if this happens this is what i'm going to do this is the amount of risk i'm going to take mm-hmm. such that when the signal appears it's mm-hmm. a matter of flow you're just going in the rhythm with the market like mm-hmm. you're not again starting to second guess yourself mm-hmm. like the, the friend you're saying that one is she or she is very she is very far from becoming a trader true is one she needs to have the confidence to lose and then do the work to change that confidence of losing into the confidence to win so how do you get the confidence <laughs> to lose you have to be courageous yeah, and accepting the field you're getting exactly into. Mm. Yeah, you can't come into trading it's already a field where you lose exactly and then you don't want to accept lose accept it to <laughs> <laughs> <Exactly. laughs> yeah. and you know you can't accept it by theoretically you have to lose Of course. Mm. I like you lose trade because hey, you lose low. money, you lose. Paka uone kumbe ah kumbe hata kulusi dangerous hivyo. Kitu ya kawaida yani. 